What's up guys, hope you all are doing well. Today we are going shopping. So I've been training for the Rogue Invitational as many of you know, and the training has been hard. The training has been heavy. I've been very beat up. And aside from all the recovery work that I've been trying to do, the next thing that I needed to look at was my diet. And with the diet, if I'm not eating enough to recover from my training, I'm gonna stay sore, I'm gonna stay beat up. And so I talked to Nathan, I said, hey man, I think we've gotta switch the diet up and plug in some more food, get me some more calories uh, so I can start recovering from my training and feel a little bit better, uh, just feeling stronger overall. And so he said, hey, let's do it, uh, set me a new diet. And so now I need to go to the store and get the food to execute that diet. So that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna bring you guys along for the ride and hopefully it'll be a lot of fun. So one of the options I get on the new diet is a variety of different fruit and then I have to choose from those fruit options. So one of the options that I really love and I love getting from here at Costco is Honeycrisp apples. And these apples are always uh, a good size and I don't know, they, all, they always taste really, really amazing and they make the diet more enjoyable. So uh, I'm gonna get plenty of apples for, uh, for this new diet. Now I will have other fruit and we'll grab some of that here in, in just a second. So next up we've got blackberries and this is another one of my favorites. I very much enjoy uh, throwing some blackberries in with the fruit options. So I'll choose most of the meals where I get an option, I'll get a, uh, an apple, blackberries, blueberries, um, or I think I can throw in an orange. I'm not a, a huge fan of oranges. I do like some orange juice, but uh, for whatever reason, I don't know, that's from when I was a kid or what, uh, I don't really, really care for those as much. So luckily I get a choice. So I always tend to go with the apples or the blackberries or the blueberries, which are right here. So those are great and uh, these are great because um, the boys like them as well. So if I get extra, they always tend to eat those, um, eat those up as well. So uh, we got the fruit options, so we will move on to some other things I need. So another thing that I am going to need is spinach. And the baby spinach here is good. Uh, I tend to eat the spinach in different ways. I'll either mix it in with the food um, sometimes I eat it kind of as like a salad on its own, um, but spinach is definitely needed. And along with the spinach, I need to have a, uh, this is perfect. It's like, like they're ready for me here or something, but uh, a spring mix uh, salad as well. So I'm gonna eat uh, salad with, um, I believe salad is with, with one of my meals and then spinach option is with a couple other meals, but uh, definitely still, Getting the, uh, the fruits and the veggies, uh, the leafy greens in, uh, in the diet is very, very important. So I just have to point this out. This might be one of the most Costco American things that I have ever seen, but quite literally you can buy an entire bucket of decorating icing. So this, uh, this, not happen to be on my diet so i can't uh, can't get that but i just had to point that out because i've never seen that and it's it's uh slightly ridiculous as you guys know i get a lot or all of my meat i should say from trifecta at this point but i do have steak as an option for one of the meals uh in in my day so i eat a lot of bison uh, as you guys know i used to get all the bison uh ground from here that's all from trifecta, so that makes it super easy. But since I'm here, I am going to grab a uh, steak. So I get filet uh, for one of the meals, so I will cook these up. It will make Carrie happy, it'll make the boys happy. So this is kind of a, uh, a treat that I'm gonna plug in, but uh, I always get excited about steak and it's, uh, it's hard to beat the steaks here at Costco for sure. One of my favorite things to grab here at Costco is actually this uh, alkaline water and I'm a big fan of drinking that when I can. I've, you know, without going into all the uh, 
research, whatever, but um, I feel like it does a really good job of getting me hydrated. It's maybe something that a Mr. Edward Hall could learn about, possibly. I am just constantly dehydrated. Limiting factor, really, and I'm limited by how hydrated I am. Very, very, very dehydrated, but I typically grab two or three cases of this when I'm here because I like drinking it and it's delicious. This is not actually on the diet, but this is one of the most important parts of eating a ton of food. Flushable wipes. You gotta stay clean, you gotta stay fresh, and uh, we all know it's just part of what we all do every day. So those are going in for sure. Mm. Well, walking through the uh, frozen section here, and I just spotted this. Mini cheesecake treats. Now, as of this moment, this is not on my diet, but I know Nathan, and I will get a cheat meal at some point, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to get these, and I'm gonna save them for that moment, because you guys know I love cheesecake, and cheesecake treats are speaking my language right now. On top, on top of this, the cheesecake treats obviously convinced somebody to put back this, this entire cheesecake into the freezer and go for the, the cheesecake treat. So whoever designed the, um, the packaging, the marketing on that did a good job because they're uh, obviously selling their product well. No good Costco trip would be complete without getting a 50 pound bag of this Calrose rice. As you guys know, that is my favorite. I very much enjoy this. And as you can guess, rice is part of the new diet so we're gonna go ahead and throw that down here not throw it over the shelf i still have not attempted that i feel like they might be challenging me though by adding more pallets to the top that would be quite a throw but i still would get it done so we can see another decision was made here somebody was looking at pasta sauce and decided that it was not a good time to buy an assortment of legendary milk chocolates. I mean, that does look delicious, but we're getting to the end of the store, and obviously this person was feeling guilty about this choice, and I don't know if it's verified if they got the pasta sauce or not, but they definitely left that behind. So they could have went and actually put it away. That would have been nicer. They should have made this choice in pasta sauce. This is delicious. I can definitely tell you that um, those will be going on a few of my meals for sure. So just so you guys know, I asked Terry, my wife, when we were coming to the store, if she wanted anything from Costco while I was here, and she just got back to me now that we have made it through the store. So being the good husband that I am, I'm going to go back to the fruit section and uh, grab what she asked me to grab. So we're gonna venture back there and get that and then come all the way back here to check out. A few moments later. <laughs> all right, we made it back to the first section of the store that we were in and I'm grabbing a uh, cantaloupe for my wife. Now I am not an expert in picking these out at all. I don't know what to look for. So hopefully I'm just gonna go for this in the back. Actually, that one doesn't look very good. Okay, that's it. Those are those are the cantaloupes we're going with. And hopefully she only wants two. Because that's what <laughs> that's what I'm grabbing. So this is this is interesting. So I just pulled up Instagram real quick while I'm waiting to check out. And Julius Maddox, the opening line, let me see if I can play it for you. He said, I, I believe he said he is the best basketball player over 400 pounds on the planet. Obviously, he must have forgot that I played basketball at a high level in college. So I feel like that's a uh, interesting claim. Let me know what you guys think in the comments uh, because that's kind of a bold statement. He's trying to call out Shaq. I don't even know if Shaq is over 400 pounds right now, but I am and I have played basketball. So. I feel like that's a bold claim and a uh, claim that you, Julius Maddox, cannot make right now. 
One of the things with shopping at Costco that's universally true is you walk out with way more than you intend on getting when you go to shop here. So I was amazed at myself because I feel like I'm just going to get a few things to fill in my diet and then I end up with an entire cart full of uh, stuff. Now, all of this stuff is necessary as I pointed out, uh, especially this. This is definitely necessary because I'm excited about that. But this is all, uh, like I said, part of my diet. So we're gonna get it loaded up. We're gonna make it happen and uh, get to eating. And it's gonna be a lot of eating, but I feel like it's gonna help my performance. I feel like it's gonna help my recovery. And that right now is the name of the game going into this next contest. So I hope you guys have enjoyed the video. For now, go out and be great, and we'll check you guys later.